the beast breaks. Hello everyone, the beast here with another Lego tutorial. Today we are going to be making this base design, no pun intended, of the Citadel Tower from Rogue One, a Star Wars story. This is, of course, a base design, so if you want to add your own flair and taste to it, then you can. Of course, it is, you don't need to copy it, um, but if you want to, that's fine. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Now, Citadel Tower actually separates into three different bits. So, we take these bits off here. They're sort of like the side bits. We'll just put them over here for now. And we can actually take the whole tower off. Like that. We will look at the ground bit first. So, let's get into it. Now, this is the ground area of the base on Scarif. Now, on Scarif, we did see bushes, sand, and lagoony type of water. And this green represents the bushes. The fawny bits represent the sand. And the two nice coloured blue, light blue, uh, represents the water. Now, on this build, you will need a slot for Citadel Tower. Um, in this build, it is six by two studs, so six studs long and uh, two studs up. You'll need these two one by two jumper plates, because if we take a wall piece, which we will look into those later, they go on sort of on an angle like this, so you will need that. Um, other than that, this is the ground design. Um, we will go on to the train bit of the Scarif build. Uh, this is the entrance, or this represents the entrance to the uh, Citadel Tower, so we just put that on. Um, next we have these uh, one by 2 grill plates here. Of course we can have four of them, and they can go along here, so I'll put some on. Of course these grills sort of look like train tracks. Now, we do also have this piece here, or these three pieces, and this represents the cargo train bit. So we can stick that wherever we want, we could stick that up close to, Citad to the entrance of Citadel Tower, we could stick it here, here, or here. Uh, for the moment, I will put it here. So yeah, here's the train design. Um, and this is just the base design. Of course, you can change the design, like you can make the water recede a bit, or make the like a little river going under here. That is totally up to you. Anyway, that is the base of the base design. Um, let's move into Citadel Tower itself. Now we take a look at Citadel Tower, which is the high-class data storage for the Empire on the planet Scarif. Uh, this is the base design of it. Um, of course you could add things on the wall, you know, you could basically make it your own. However, we will look at it in depth. So if I break this down, um, this first bit here is just some, it's just a 6 by 2 brick here, along with some, well, it would be a 1 by 6 brick here, and yeah, on the back I added this sort of rail plate here, it's a rail plate, just to add some detail. And of course we have these angled inverted slopes, I guess they're called, 1 by 3s, just to add that, you know, there's wings that sort of jut out that way and that way on the tower itself. Next, we have the control point, which is basically just, you know, two stacks of 1x2 bricks with you know, that, basically. Of course, we have this, which is the glass sort of watch point of Citadel Tower, and this basically goes on there. Next, the next ones are pretty simple. This is literally just a stack of 2x4 bricks. We don't really need to go into that much. Next, we have the uh, yeah, stack of 2x2 two two 
bricks. He's gone now. Next we have the actual dish piece that um, was used to transmit the Death Star plans up to the profundity. Um, this is very simple. If I break it down some more, it's literally just a 2x2 two two jumper plate with a 1x1 one one clip. And yeah, this bit is basically just like this mini pistol gun here with a 2x2 two two inverted dish that goes on like that. So yeah, that is basically Citadel Tower. Of course, you can make it your own. Uh, these bits here are the angled walls, because this is an angled fortress. These are just made by 1x2x3 uh, sort of slopes. Uh, we need four of them, and these just stack up. Um, if we actually get to the ground, the base, of course we can put Citadel Tower in this gap here. So this just fits nicely in here, like that, oh, no, not like that, like that. Um, next, to put the uh, angled bits in, we will take this, and we actually need to put this, this stud in here, uh, we need to put it there, and we need to get the middle of this bit, the middle of that, into there. So if I do so, I'll try and zoom it up, it goes in like that. So you see that stud there isn't on, it's the middle bit. And we do the same with the other one. Of course we put that middle bit in. And that is Scarif Tower, or Citadel Tower. You tower on Scarif. Now this is ready to... Transmit the Death Star plans to the profundity, and of course, let the rebels destroy the first Death Star, which I didn't really like, but you know. Anyway, that is the video, so if you liked it, please remember to subscribe and slap the bell to turn on notifications so you never miss another video. This video, of course, was sponsored by Dr. Atomic Storm. Um... He doesn't have a channel yet, but he will, so yeah, remember to check him out in a couple of months. Um, the links to my channel should be coming up here soon, and other videos. Anyway, this is the Beast going out. Goodbye, everyone.